Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Raj here. Today is Arca Night in America. It is my sixth Arca race this year. I'm gonna just get this out the way. I'm in Des Moines, Iowa. I've never seen this part of the world before. Got my ones on today. So I believe it's 150 laps tonight. 45 minute practice, two lap qualifying. I'm excited. I feel the most prepared for this race that I've really ever been so far this year. Also happens to be bike week. We've, we changed hotels. Dude, what the is hell no. <laughs> and got a rental car towed. It's been a pretty eventful last little bit. This is how you know this hotel's good. So you gotta tap your key card to press the button to go up. Yeah, but we're just gonna ignore the fact that it, I, would, I, kept, I kept pressing one instead of seven. We're just gonna ignore that. That was very embarrassing. Say hi. Hi. Do you have any words to say? Good morning to everyone. Um, yeah. Or tell the internet what drink you have. I have a Grande Nitro Gold Brew with Sweet Cream, my go-to drink. Jesus. And they obviously did not put enough milk, so that's why it's turning brown. So. Awesome. Still good. Chris, did you get anything? I did not. Not a coffee drinker. Same. tires lose grip then the bumps become worse and then I'm moving to the second lane or lane and a half up just migrate up a little bit until you find that sweet spot on the racetrack that your car likes Surprise! All right, so still so go th going through tech. I just threw my stuff back here. It is uh, 1:48, so a little over two hours until first crack or the only practice we'll have today. So. So I just finished the drivers' meeting. Practice starts a little less, like 45 minutes. So I'm excited. Pretty, I'm pretty excited. So I think we'll have a good night tonight, but we'll see gonna be driving the driving with the spec motor versus an Elmore so see how even they are it's hot very hot well actually it's not that bad but see if you sit in it and I got a lot a black shirt so it, it'll be hot but I'll be all right
was that? Huh? How was that? It's alright. It's not. I think we'll be okay. So, just gotta cool off. Cool off and, uh, I'm about to go meet some, uh, boys and girls club kids, so that'll be fun. to go race in uh, only five minutes so I'm excited hopefully that it'll go to plan and we'll have some fun I'm excited I'm, I'm very excited so <laughs> So, on the grid here. And here's the office. A little dusty up there, but really fine. Matt, you want me in the vlog? Sure. This is Matt. Hey, I'm here to take pictures of him, but he's doing video right now, so like, yes. Exactly. See you after. corner and Raja was not clear. I like how he's fighting the wheeler. He's really getting after this thing. Good job for his first time at Iowa Speedway. Now the hands out the window, cautions out on the racetrack. There is Carruth with the suit chief onboard camera, steady at this stage of the game. I'm sure Raja's just trying to figure things out here in Iowa. And a unique opportunity for some of these E-Series drivers to come over to what essentially is a national circuit, compete on the biggest short track on the planet basically the fastest one if that there you see the 25 and the 23 brett holmes and jesse love duking it out right in front of Raja Ruth. <laughs> times if Ty Gibbs stayed in the Arkham Art Series I can tell you he'd be he'd be right up there for multiple wins here at this racetrack I would just ride on board with Raja Karuth <laughs> the, the rest of the show honestly because we know Ty Gibbs is kicking everybody's butt Raja Karuth every time somebody gets to his left rear quarter panel he's just moving that wheel left and right here comes Brent Holmes now trying to pick up a spot on Karuth this is a battle for ninth I see 10 races here this year maybe because Raja Karuth is so entertaining to watch that speed Brent can't get a good run to get that position I'm sure Raja at this point in the race is not going to run him that hard if, if Brent gets a good run on him they're going to he's going to give him room to run. Raja's just been so fast on that corner exit to keep right behind him. By the way, keeping an eye on our scoring chart, right now Daniel Dye trying to cut into Ty Gibbs' lead. Uh, roll reversal from last week when Gibbs almost caught Daniel Dye at the end of the race. Right now. So we're done at Iowa, finished ninth, kind of bummed. I mean, we didn't run any much better than I think seventh or eighth. So finished better than where we qualified at. But uh, that last run, like we started off tight to, to make sure that we were not too loose at the end of the run. And it just kind of 
got too free towards the end to do anything. And then after the race, I about passed out. Learn and go to our next race. I'm not sure when my next ARCA race will be, but there's some positives to take away from tonight. First time at this racetrack, second time at a big racetrack. On top of being the second East car and being the highest finishing car with the Yates motor versus an Elmore. Overall, not terrible. Wanted to finish better, but the car is clean and we'll rebuild and learn for the next one. So thank you everybody for watching. See you guys in the next video. So see y'all.